So this is a brand new, I've had it for about two hours. Um, this is a Generac IQ3500. And uh, it's dead on arrival, it's not producing any power. We'll see it here when I turn it on in the display in a second. Um, I have to return this to Amazon now. Uh, but also, the uh, exhaust is misaligned, so it's already melted. All of this plastic here, this should be right in the center here. It's elevated right up, so it melted that. This is absolutely brand spanking new. Uh, let's start this up. Make sure economy is off. Engine is already hot, so I don't need to put the choke on. We'll use the electric start. Well. God. And now it's not even turning over. Oh wow. Oh, I put the choke on, but I mean the engine's hot. I just turned it off before making the video. Nope. That's I can smell gasoline. Let's try to. What a coincidence, huh? So I can't even show you. Anyway, on the display it said zero volts. And there's a little hourglass up the top left here um, that was on. All of the breakers are fine. Starting it without a load. Let's try again. Economy is off. We're on run. Oh, wow. Oh, here we go, here we go. No, 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 it tried. Unbelievable. It's doing its best, I guess. Well, it started up just straight away before. I didn't have any trouble starting it until now. You can hear it trying. Brand spanking new, has the oil in it, it's full of gasoline, the Generac IQ3500, I don't know if I've just got a lemon, but uh, several problems, wasn't producing current, it melted the front, melted with the, uh, maybe the, the rear, depending on how you want to define it, it's melted this plastic here. And now it won't even kick over. And it doesn't have to be on choke. Before somebody in the comments tells me, well, it should be on choke, well, no, the engine is hot. So it says not to put it on choke when the engine is hot. Well, there you go. Going back to Amazon. So it just got started and then it quit, but it wasn't turning over properly. Let's see if I can get it. Now, when this first turned over, it just turned over. I didn't have to hold down this button at all. It just worked. Here we go, here we go. Here we go. And I did this just before and then it quit. It's running really rich. The choke is not on, it's on run. Locked into place, it's definitely on run. You can see it's not producing any volts, but you'd expect that because it's not running properly. It's producing smoke. I don't know if you can see that. The wind's kind of blowing it away. You can see how it's burning. Here we go. Oh, here we go. And the economy is not on, if you're wondering. We should 
couldn't start it with the economy on. Wow, we got it to go again. As you can see, there's no volts though. a lemon and I caught them here at misfiring okay let's cut it off put that back on there so I called generic and um, they uh, they said it's not very common to get a dead on arrival unit um, they wanted me to take it to a service center. I was like, I've had it for two hours. I'm not taking it to a service center. Obviously, I'm just gonna return it to Amazon and that's what's gonna happen now. Thank goodness I didn't cut the box like they suggest you do, which is to use a razor blade and cut the sides of the box so you can fold it all open. No, no, I, I cut the bottom open and then let it you know, lifted the box off of it. And uh, glad I did that. Now I'm going to put it back in its box and ship it back to, uh, Amazon. <laughs>